I'm Anil Kumar sharing with you a question from my subscriber. Let me thank all the viewers and subscribers for watching my videos keenly and posting excellent questions. I hope this solution will help many of you. The question is based on application of Pythagorean theorem. A triangle PQR has vertices at P, 8, 6, Q, 0, 2 and R, 2, R. Find the value of R when triangle PQR has a right angle at P. So let's uh, construct a triangle kind of like this where we have right angle at P. Coordinates given to us are for P it is 8, 6. For Q it is let us say, let's write Q here, we have 0, 2. And for R, it is 2R. Right. Okay. So, this is just an approximate drawing which helps you to just solve the question. We have not used a coordinate plane at all to place them properly. Now in a right triangle, you know, sum of squares of the smaller sides is equal to the square of hypotenuse. So we can write down our equation as PQ square plus PR square equals to QR square, right? So that's the Pythagorean theorem. Now to find the distance PQ, we will use the formula, which is the distance formula. So as a reminder, let me write down distance formula here as square root of x2 minus x1 whole square plus y2 minus y1 whole square. And when I square, then we get rid of the square root. We get x2 minus x1 whole square plus y2 minus y1 whole square. Now you may also need the formula for x2 minus x1 whole square since we are using a variable here, right? So let me write another formula which will be of use to us uh, that we could write like a minus p whole square will be a square minus 2ab plus b square. Now with most of the things already explained, I would like you to pause the video and answer this question. Okay. okay, now let's find out all these sides. So PQ, rather PQ square is going to be 8 minus 2, 8 minus 0, I'm sorry, plus square, plus 6 minus 2, whole square, right? Now that gives us 64, 8 square plus 4 square. So what? you can do is you can use calculator right so let me rewrite this 8 square plus 6 minus 2 is 4 4 square 64 plus 16 right so let's do 8 square plus 4 square equals to 80 so we get the length square of pq now let's find what pr is pr square we'll calculate PR square will be 8 minus 2 whole square plus 6 minus R whole square. Now 8 minus 2 is 6. We can write 6 square and let us expand 6 minus 2 R, 6 minus R whole square using this formula, right? So we get plus 6 square minus 2 times 6 is 12 R and plus R square. So that gives us 36, 36 is 72. So we can write this as, let's write down here. So we get 72 minus 12R plus R square. Okay. So that is PR square. What is QR square? So QR square will be equal to 2 minus 0 whole square plus r minus 2 whole square, r minus 2 whole square. That gives us 2 square plus, again apply this formula, 
we get r square minus 2ab which is 4r uh, plus 2 square so that gives us 4 plus 4 as 8 and we have plus r square minus 4r now we are going to substitute these three values into our first equation right which is pythagorean theorem pq square plus pr square means 80 plus pr square is 72 minus 12r plus r square is equal to qr square which is 8 uh, plus r square minus 4r now we can bring the variables on one side and constants on the other side so we get 80 plus 72 minus 8 equals to r square minus 4r minus r square plus 12r correct okay so let's solve this equation r square minus r square is 0 so we have a linear equation so we could write this as let's calculate the left side which is 80 plus 72 minus 8 equals to 144 and let's write down here so we have 144 80 plus 72 minus 8 is equal to minus 4 plus 12 which is 8 right so 8 r so that gives you the value of r as 144 divided by 8 so I'm going to divide this by 8 to get the answer so that gives us the value of r as 18 right? so r is 18 for us so that is how we could actually solve this particular question right so i hope uh, the concept is clear so r is 18. feel free to write your comments and share your views and if you really like and subscribe to my videos that'd be great thanks for watching and all the best